here I've got a, a general form of a quadratic expression ax squared plus bx plus c and these are some examples of quadratic expressions so you can compare you've got the x squared term x term number term so here the 3 a is equal to 3 b is equal to 2 c is equal to 5 and so on right this one you're probably thinking well where is the x term well the x term is it's 0x so that could be written as 6x squared plus 0x plus 3 but we tend not to write 0x right it's not absolutely necessary to have the letter x it could be any letter so you could have for example instead of x you could have had 3n squared plus 2n plus 5 and the other thing i just want to mention is yes i said this is a a is equal to 3 b is equal to 2 c is equal to 5 here a is equal to 5 but here b is actually equal to negative 2 so the sign is always important so this one, a is equal to 5, b is equal to negative 2, c is equal to 7. Generate the first three terms for this expression. First three terms. So replace the x with 1. And then see what value comes out. And then replace it with 2 and then replace it with 3. We'll stop with 1. Replace x with 1, replace x with 1, don't forget the plus symbol, and don't forget, don't forget minus 2. So bit mass, um, indices first, 1 squared is 1, times the 2 is 2, 5 times 1 is 5, 2 plus 5 is 7, 7 times 2 is 5, the first one is 5 let's replace the x with the second one the 2 right, this bit now replace x with 2 so you've got 2 squared and then times by 2 Place x with 2, don't forget the plus and the minus and the 2. Right, 2 squared is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, That's 10, 18, take away 2, 16. That's the second term. Right, third term, replace x with 3. Squares so nine nine times two is eighteen. Right, eighteen at fifteen is thirty three. Thirty three take away two is thirty one. So here we have it: first, second, and third term belonging to this quadratic expression. Right, there is a quick way of getting these numbers first second third term from this expression using a calculator so if you've got one of these types of calculators you can try this right press mode setup option number three table because i'm going to generate a table like this option number three right, f of x well this is where you're going to enter this expression So you two. Well, how am I going to get the x? Well, there is. I'll show you. You can see the x there. Now to activate that, you need to press the alpha button and then followed by this button here. I'll show you. So alpha, 
and then this one. There you go, I've got the X now. Press the squared button. Oops, five. X again. So alpha minus two. Press the equal button. Right, what number do I need to start at? One, because it's the first one. Well, one is already displayed, so I don't need to change that. Press the equal button. Where do I need to end? Three, third. So change that to a three. Change it to a three, and then press the equal button there. Now these numbers, one, two, three, four, eight, okay, these are going up in steps of one. So one is already displayed, so I don't need to change that. Press the equal button. So there you go. The table is going downwards. The first one is five. There you go, the first one is five. The second one is 16. Second one is 16. Third one is 31. Third one is 31. Right, to get rid of this, right, press the AC button. But then the problem is that still stays there. So what you can do to get rid of that, press the mode setup button and then press option number one. And that takes you back to a normal calculator.